Hey everybody, how are you doing today? Oh yes, indeed, things are getting better and better. Very soon we're gonna have the app terror in our hands and driving it around. Won't that be an exciting day? So we're gonna talk about the PI, one and two. Let's get into it. All right, everybody, how are you doing? Welcome back to my channel. It's good to have you here. Aptarians, it's going to happen very soon, and we are so looking forward to it. But it looks like Aptera is ready to get things rolling. And very soon now, we're going to have the Aptera in our hands. This is going to be a very big year. Aptera is getting the PI together. And I like how they stated how they're actually going to do that. And let's check this video out. Um, and we're preparing for our first production intent build. So uh, we set aside areas downstairs, um, you know, basically where we built the gamma vehicle. Uh, but we have two stalls uh, ready to start the production intent builds. And we're starting to acquire those parts now. And as we get into 2024, more and more of those uh, will arrive there. Now, as we talk about the PI builds, I just, uh, for our guests, I want to make one uh, clarification. So we use the word production intent and progressive interchangeably here within the company. And the reason for that is each one of these builds, starting with P1 all the way to P16, are progressively more and more and more towards production. And But all of them are design intent, so they'll be able to be upfitted with whatever production intent part they have. So, for example, some of the early PI builds won't have HVAC, but when we release that HVAC system, it goes right into the place that's already designed into the bank. So. Yeah, it is interesting to note that a lot of the mechanical features of the vehicle uh, will look very production intent. Um, you know, they, they may not be built out of production molds, but they'll be production intent designs. So maybe a CNC cut instead of out of a die cast mold. Um, that's a good example. Or off, um, they, I think, as they say in Italy uh, or at CPC, off tool, off process. So yeah. thing, the, the ultimate is off tool, off process, meaning it's production tool and it's with the production process. But there may be some things, even in the early builds, that are... Uh, a, a specialized process because we just haven't committed to that tool yet and every manufacturer does that you may have you know an engine that comes from a factory but you may have a sun visor that's made at some uh, uh, small volume shop for example so as you can see that they already had a spot set up for them to go ahead and start putting the pi1 together and that they're going to go ahead and start doing that no doubt they are actually you know, making sure everything, every part that they have fits properly and make sure that the bank is perfectly designed the way they want it to be. But I like what he said that they can actually take uh, the P1 and actually turn it into a P2, uh, even though that they're doing all the testing for what equipment they already have for the P1. So no doubt if they wanted to, they could take the P1 and turn it into the P16 if they wanted to. However, um, I'm pretty sure some of the testing that they're going to do may damage the vehicle or the part. So, of course, if that happens, then if the da vehicle gets damaged, they're just going to have to move on to the next bank. But anyway, that sounds so exciting, knowing that they are getting this together. And so no doubt we will probably get a lot more information on that probably around the end of this month. And all is just, just great news knowing that Aptera is almost ready. They are almost there to get this baby out. How do you feel about what you're hearing now? Isn't that just fantastic news that they are getting ready to come out with the Aptera? Yes, I am so looking forward to getting the keys put in my hand. That's going to be awesome. But I also want to show this to you that Aptera, they are still continuing to bring in money. Um, the last time I checked, let me show this to you. Um, as you can see here, they're at uh, 35 million point oh three. So they've added $30,000 from what I can tell. And I'm wondering if that came from the, because when I checked them when they did 
finally reached zero, they was only at 33 million point three two. So they've added quite a bit. They've added at least uh, two more million dollars. And so, I mean, this would be a good company to invest in. This is the best time to do that right now. And I'm not a financial advisor. This would be a good company to do your research on, do your homework, look into, talk to your financial advisor, see if this is something that you want to get involved with while the shares are at 1050, um, $10 and 50 cents a share. So talk to your financial advisor, see if that's something you want to do. And if you don't have a thousand dollars, you want to invest, that's okay too. You can go to the Republic and you can invest $210. I mean, who can't afford $210? That's of course, I mean, it's something that you have to make up in your mind that that's what you want to do. And if not, I totally understand. I mean, everybody, it's not for everybody. Everybody can't do this. But I mean, this would be a good company to invest in right now before they come out with their IPO. Now, I think a good bit of people have already invested. When I go to the Republic website, you can see it's at uh, $1.702837 million dollars. 1.702 and the last time I checked was the beginning of or the end of March and there it was actually at 16 or 1.678298 million so they're still getting people involved in them which is good um, because when they come out a lot of people are going to jump on this this is really going to make some money. But even if you don't want to do all that, you know, what you could do is you could go to their website and, you know, just if you want to go ahead and get you an Aptera, hit my link down below and it'll bring you to this site. All you have to do is put $70 down. It'll take $30 off and you could design the Aptera you want. And you could have one of these babies on the road. Uh, the sooner you sign up, the sooner you get your Aptera. Right now, you're probably going to be waiting about two years, maybe a year and a half. Just depends on how fast they ramp up. But anyway, once again, just tell me how you feel about what's going on. Very soon now, we're going to be seeing the PI and they're going to start doing all their testing. But... If you're new here, hit the like, ring the bell, subscribe, and you catch all my videos when they come out. Or you could check all my videos that I've already come out with. I, all I talked about was Aptera and the movement that they're making and the advancements that they're making in their vehicle. But my patrons, thank you very much. You guys are awesome. I mean, what can I say about you? You're so loyal. You're there and you're sticking with me. You're helping me continue to put this channel out. And, you know, that's why I'm putting all the videos out because of your help. And if you want to help me out, if you want to become a patron, just go to the link down below and then hit, hit the join button. But you guys have a good one. Y'all take care. I really love talking about Aptera. And very soon, oh yeah, we're going to have our Aptera and driving that baby around. Oh, I'm so looking forward to that. Y'all take care. Have a good one. We'll catch you in the next video. Bye-bye.